Today we're checking out the brand new Tone X pedal by IK Multimedia. Chris here. Hey, my name is Guillaume. Hope you're having a great day today, because today is a great day. Today, for all lovers of things compact and uh, do not at all, <laughs> but like do one thing really good, uh, because today <laughs> is the release day for the Tone X pedal by IK Multimedia slash Amplitube slash machine modeling. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Machine Modeling sent us a pedal to, uh, uh, to check it, it out. Uh, <laughs> So, what is this? The first yeah. thing that should be clarified, because they have a couple of other pedals, the X Time, the X Drive, like, what X -time, is that? X Time, X Space, X Drive, and those were the first yeah. steps of, from Amplitude going from software into hardware, and uh, there were basically a delay, uh, multi-mode delay, multi-mode reverb, and multi-mode drive. And pedals. there's a vibe too, yeah. Yes, and so what this is, is not only like a, a, a preamp sort of uh, emulator, a preamp simulation, but also uh, you've got all the possibilities possible with IRs and uh, capturing your own rig from just the amp to the amp with the speaker to the amp with the speaker and the pedal in front or whatever you have. So there is um, the, the capturing aspect of that as well as everything you can expect, uh, you can expect from Amplitube in terms of uh, you know, putting your own patches, building your own presets, not only on the website, but also just on the pedal, yeah. not website, sorry, software, uh, but also just on the pedal itself. Uh, so the, the thing is that this Tone X thing came out already, which was just a little unit, which was uh, there to plug in whatever you wanted, mm. like your uh, speaker output from yeah, your yeah. amplifier, and you could capture the tones of your rig. This is a standalone hardware unit and it's like literally your computer plus the actual hardware interface yeah. built in one box. You put that in your gig bag, you have all your amps captured or all the other capture profiles, whatever mm. uh, you wanna uh, grab from the um, that community. Yeah. Uh, just load them on there, use whichever IRs and you're ready to go. The cool thing about this is that it's also really, uh, it's targeted towards obviously people that are coming from software and that are used to using Amplitude because the interface is going to be very, like it's very similar. Uh, it's a different process because we're talking about uh, like your actual tone, like your actual amp snapshot yeah, type yeah. of thing. Uh, but uh, it's also built in a way that if you've never touched a computer in your life, this is fine. Like you can yeah. still, uh, select all the different amps, all the different like settings, and like it's super intuitive. Uh, so we'll be doing like a little bit of both, like a little bit of sound tweaking. We might save a couple of presets, that kind of thing, just to show how that's done. Maybe put a couple of pedals into it. Maybe use it standalone. You know. This is the same yeah, sound nice. you played in the intro, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. As far as the layout goes, uh, you have gonna you're gonna be able to cycle through your presets with that uh, little putty right there, that little nubby. Uh, but you can also do it with your foot by either going bank up and selecting. <laughs> a <laughs> it's a wobbly, wobbly, wobbly case. <laughs> we have and, uh, and selecting then uh, any sort of preset that are in that bank. 
uh, on this side you can select the model depending on on which side of the uh, the, the sound you are. You get yeah. different amp, amp models, cab, yeah. different cab models, and then you have your regular uh, gain, bass, mid, treble uh, settings. Which is now at 5.1. At 5.1, your master volume, and then you have an alternative alt button, and now that becomes reverb, compressor, ah, noise gate, sweet. presence, and depth. Yeah. Super easy to use. Uh, and let's say, for example, we were on crunchy, right there. That was our, our setting. You're like, mm -hmm. you're happy with the sound. Yeah. Yeah, but you really, really love reverb. Oh, yes, please. So you go into the alt mode, you push the reverb to. 80 because because you like it more yes please that's nice and also i would love some compression please some compression mm -hmm. oh we can we can add Nice. All right, so okay. you want to do a Brad Paisley preset. Uh, you should first learn how to play. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> but uh, so yeah, that's how it's done. You're still in the alt mode, but it doesn't matter. You can always click on the um, the preset knob. Uh, it? The uh, yeah, no, the uh, preset knob. But you stay pressed on it, and that's the save mode. Yes, yes, saved, done. Cool. And that's your Brad Paisley preset now. <laughs> Let me try with a, like, I'll push it with an overdrive. Yeah, sweet. Bit. Is literally just the amp yeah. with reverb, compression, noise gate, like practical features that are related to an amp uh, and it doesn't want to replace everything else. Yeah, no, it's nice that it does everything that goes kind of like after the amp yeah. in general. Yeah. So you're thinking about noise gates and, and compressors and whatnot, like mostly for like hard rock, like gainy sounds yeah. type of thing. Yeah. But yeah, just the fact that it's not trying to do everything and just does that and you can do your own thing around it. It's kind of cool. I like that. Very cool. I uh, like that very much. I'd, I'd like to have some um, American uh, clean thingy. Yeah, I'm not doing that with that guitar. <laughs> no, no, no. Let me let me help you. If you can uh, find something. For American me. clean. Yes.
Looking forward to hearing the video mostly because right now it's always like when we film those units, we could have gone from that into like a clean power amp. Uh, that's absolutely fine as well. Like you can take it out mono. Right now we're doing stereo into the DI box into the interface and we have like a feedback with monitors with wedges. And it's always kind of weird in the room to like get an impression of exactly how yeah. it's going to sound through any other medium. Yeah. So I'm looking forward to seeing the video. But right yeah. now it feels like you're on stage yeah, yeah, you yeah. Have your wedges in front of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. which is of, cool, but it's a different experience. Yeah, I kind of f uh, forgot to to mention that as well, like the uh, the I/O on the back. Um, so you've got your inputs, and that's obviously going to be either from your guitar. Right now, we're going from uh, the pedal board. So you guitar, know, pedal board, exactly. So yeah. that's last in chain, and uh, we're going stereo out. This is quarter inch out into the DI. Next to it, I forgot what it was. Uh, MIDI's. Headphones out. Uh, headphones. And then, then we MIDI's. have MIDI in and out, and uh, the. Exp uh, external control which can uh, be assigned to an expression parameters, pedal yeah. and different parameters if you want to swell in like the reverb or like the amount of gain you want or whatever all of that can be programmed as well as a USB hub that can be used with a USB cable <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> uh, to your computer to either upload patches or do firmware updates and that kind of thing. It does react to pedals really well too so yeah. if you're into that kind of thing it definitely does a great job. This is how a happy Guillaume looks like. This was the part the into the Nebulous Vibrato, into the Empress Delay, into the Fling <laughs> Reverb and Harmonic Tram. Enough uh, pedal love. Um, this is a baritone. It's, it's a called cool a one, baritone. <laughs> baritone. <laughs> baritone. <laughs> and um, this is a ridiculously cool guitar. I want to I wanna chug us out. Yeah, I think we should definitely tell them to subscribe before we go. Uh, good call. And don't miss out on the bell, because that bell does wonders. Uh, we've <laughs> done a it. lot of other cool videos today, yesterday and the day before. We're exhausted. Um, <laughs> yes. but it's been really good fun. Don't miss out on those videos. Click subscribe, hit the bell, uh, like this video. If you did, let us know in the comments. What do you think? What do you think of the Tonex by IK Multi Multimedia slash Amplitube? Take care of yourselves. We'll see you down there and in the next video. Chuggy chug chug. Bye. <laughs> Chuggy chug chug.